Family, faculty, and former players are mourning a longtime North Texas high school football coach. Mark Bowles spent 26 years at Liberty Christian in Argyle as head coach and athletic director. He died last night when he wrecked his motorcycle near Corinth in, on I-35E while not wearing a helmet. Fox 4's Neha Curtis has more on Bowles' legacy right now from our Dallas newsroom. Neha. Steve, I heard so many wonderful stories today of a man who really loved life, kids, and of course football. I spoke with his son, Matt, this afternoon, and he said he's not at all surprised at the outpouring of love and support because his dad touched so many lives and was the man who built the football program at Liberty. Coach Mark Bowles will forever be remembered at Liberty Christian School. His images are plastered in the football locker room and his state championship trophies proudly displayed. He poured his life into a lot of kids uh, and football players probably first and foremost. Uh, he was an amazing football coach. Former student, player and family friend Chris Searcy tells us Coach Bowles had such a presence that even after he graduated, he still felt like Coach Bowles would always be his coach. Even as a, like a working with him up here, I would want to tuck my shirt in and make sure. I mean, he told me to do 20 push-ups. I would probably get down and do it even a couple of years ago just because of respect I have for him. This man was revered and sometimes feared, but he's remembered mostly for his off-the-wall humor, fondly named Bowles-isms. You did something extraordinary. You were a bad motor scooter, and you'd get a T-shirt that said bad motor scooter. Dad gum it or get on him like stink on a skunk or, you know, he sometimes he would just... He'd look at you and he'd start clapping his hands. And so he'd just say, ha, ah! you know, and just you just didn't know what that meant. You're just like, okay, I guess that's good. I don't know. But on and off the field, Coach Bowles not just touched lives, he changed them. He was a father figure to so many that even whenever I was here as a peer, um, you know, I'd go to him for advice. We do a lot of things uh, his way because that's how we cut our teeth. Coach Bowles was known for his passion for football and riding his Harley on a sunny day with the wind in his hair. His friend and biker buddy Michael Leonard says the coach's death is devastating, especially since he was killed on the very Harley he loved. Is this kind of a wake-up call for you almost? Every time, every time. You know, it's, uh, you know, we, uh, there are choices that a lot of us make that aren't, aren't completely wise all the time. And I, I think that, you know, I, I don't, haven't, I've heard one way or the other that whether Mark had a helmet on or not, but... I just encourage all of my biking brothers to wear their helmets. Ten years ago, Bowles started a chili cook-off to benefit wounded warriors. That cook-off will go on as planned Friday night. Bowles will also be remembered before Friday night's home game. Steve. All right, Neha, thank you.